just want to send you a quick update. Um, really quickly, one thing, I changed the layout of the cart page so it's full width and that will now enable these product images, the thumbnails to show in people's cart. Um, and then the other thing I wanted to come back to, I needed a refresher myself on the uh, related products and on individual product pages. So I'm going to show you this one for an example. I was actually wrong <laughs> about related products being something that you can completely customize. These, this section, related products, these will be pulled in, like I said before, uh, from, you know, categories that are in the same, or products that are in the same category. Um, another way you can customize this would be by using tags. So in this example, you can, if you want like this bottle to show in a related products, or maybe you want another accessory to show or another bike product, I don't know, you could start using tags on products. So for this one, a tag might be a bottle. Um, and if you use that same tag on a product that you want to be, you know, to show here under related products, you're going to enter that tag as well on that product. So that's another way to have a little more control over this. Otherwise, these are pulled in automatically. Now, this you may also like. This is determined by uh, an upsell. So this, an upsell will be shown, it will only display on the individual product pages, only in this section. And to set that, you saw that yesterday, you're gonna come in here into the product and linked products. An upsell, well, it's basically suggesting a replacement for the current product. So instead of the 500 milliliter bottle, Maybe you, you know, for example, you would like to purchase the bigger one and it might be a little bit more expensive. That's what the upsell is for. It's usually a more expensive version of the product someone's already looking at. So that you enter here. Um, maybe you, I don't know. Yeah, for another example, I'm not really sure for this one, but you get the point for that. The cross sell is something that you're suggesting um, in addition to this product. So the cross sell will show on the cart page after the person has already added this product to their cart. So for this example, these are related products to the bike bottle. So I entered them in there, updated that. You're not gonna see them right away on the product page, but I've already added this to my cart. So if we go to my cart, you'll see that because I added this product in here and because it's a cross, these are cross cells, they are going to show here. So that's how these work. Um, let me know if that makes sense. If you have any questions, 